what's up guys this is Matt here with the wise by guy uh, today I'm excited for my first review this channel has been something I've wanted to do for quite a long time um, I end up buying way more than I should on Amazon and uh, one of the things that I've always appreciated is folks who take the time to review products um, that way I can make a more informed decision so it's kind of the intent of this channel um, today my first review I'm gonna be reviewing the vertex Delta stretch jeans so uh, there are a pair of pants uh, that there's a couple other guys that review them already um, so I bought a pair wanted to try them out so I wanted to give you guys my two cents and let you know whether or not I thought these pants were a wise buy so without further ado let's get into the review okay guys so these are the Vertec Delta Stretch 2.0 pants you'll have to forgive the uh, crotch shot but um, these are the best way that I can kind of show off these pants. Um, they're a fantastically comfortable pair of pants, have oodles and oodles of pockets. So let's just start here um, from the waist down. One of the things that jumps out with these pants is they have fantastic size belt loops. Uh, the belt that I have here on is one of the Aegeus um, belts. So it's, it's one of my bigger belts. So if I'm doing some running and gunning, this is gonna be the belt that I use. Belt loops are plenty wide um, to fit larger belts. Uh, I know some guys wear Cobra belts, um, haven't had any issues, uh, seen any negative feedback on those. One of the things that I love about these pants um, is right under the belt, let me go ahead and let me slide this belt off here, is there's a set of pass-through loops right underneath the belt buckle. So it's, it's a separate side of the belt. Um, it's big enough to run some uh, zip ties, I run one of the cat tourniquets, and it, you can see it goes all the way around. We've got some nice nice uh, belt loops here in the back, but those pass-throughs run all the way in the back, so I can have my cat's tourniquet, I'm sorry, my rat's tourniquet, clipped under my belt for quick takeoff, um, so always have my tourniquet on me there. Um, on the right-hand side, we've got good-sized pockets, so we can see, I mean, it goes down mid thigh um, the pockets have this really cool mesh so it helps with some breezeability and uh, there's a little lanyard hooks in here now on the right side pocket we also have this secondary pocket um, so it goes into the same pocket so it's not great if you're wanting to keep you know we'll say um, uh, a wallet hidden in here and uh, a can of Altoids right they're, they're still both in the same pocket space, but it would be fantastic for maybe um, a passport, um, other kind of secure documents. So that is on the right side pocket. The left side pocket, just a normal pocket. Um, now one thing that's kind of nice with these pockets is they do have this kind of a, a pocket cut. So they're not like a, a jean pocket where it's a little harder to get your hand in. Nice, easy hand entry. Um, and what makes this really nice is you know, if you carry like a little Leatherman tool, something like that, you can keep that clipped here. And when you put your hand in, your, your fingers aren't getting caught up on your equipment. So love that pocket design. Now, um, these pockets also have um, extra supports, both on the right and the left. So we have a, a pocket here and we've got a pocket over here on this side. I love these pockets, um, the yoke pockets. I used to have a pair of 511 jeans and these yoke pockets were really high up and it made it hard to really get a lot of functionality of these. But these pockets are decent size. We can take uh, magazines, those fit in quite nicely. Um, so again, if you're having a range day, running, gunning, fantastic. Again, both sides of the pocket, they fit nicely. Um, you know, they're clear of your, clear of your belt. Um, but you know, I'm not walking around town with those magazines, but they are big enough. If I did want to take a cat's instead of my rat's tourniquet, almost big enough. You can kind of see, you know, it, it does stick out a little bit. Um, but again, if I've got, if I've got my shirt untucked, you know, nobody sees, nobody knows. So, um, perfect size pockets there. Um, again, I can take, I, I often use uh, Altoid cans for a uh, little extra you know, medication, pills for my wife, whatever the case may be, but those fit in nicely. And the nice thing with where these are is if I'm sitting down, it's, it's not actually 
on my butt. It's kind of over here on the side of my leg, so it's it's keeping things out of my back pockets. I'm not a huge fan of things in my back pockets. Speaking of back pockets, back pockets, um, so we've got our little side yoke pocket, and then we've got a good sized back pocket. There, there isn't a whole lot of overlap here. So um, again, they are gonna share maybe, I don't know, inch, inch and a half space, but these back pockets, I don't know if I can get to you guys, you can see it have these little flaps. So essentially it makes it harder for a pickpocket to get your wallet. So you get your wallet there, you have to just kind of take that, get your wallet out. So it's a nice little trap. And again, that is on both sides, the left and the right side of the pants. Now, the big reason I actually bought these pants is the tool pockets, the tool pockets. Um, down here on the leg, you can't really see it, it's nice and covert, are these, these extra tool pockets, which are perfect for throwing in a little flashlight. Um, you can throw in, again, your Leatherman multi-tool. Now, this is a multi-tool wave, it's a little tight, to get that in there. But fits nice, fits secure, and again, when I'm sitting, I'm not sitting on my equipment. Um, I have a pair of true spec pants, and they're just a little bit bigger, so um, these are a little tight, uh, but again, I can fit my Leatherman easily. Um, once you get it in, I can fit, this is a, uh, a Phoenix, this is my uh, LD12. That fits beautifully, uh, no problems there. If you guys carry bigger flashlights, this is a Phoenix um, PD35. Bigger flashlights, again, they fit. You just gotta make sure you, you hook it in right. So um, that's the, the major pockets. I'll show you guys, you got a couple of um, extra secret pockets. Um, I'll take the pants off to show you guys those ones. It's, it's built into the pants. Um, couple of other things really liked with the jeans. Well, pants their jeans have the same the gusseted crotch so when you're going trying to crouch kneel down I mean you guys can even see they're super super stretchy super stretchy so if you're working on your knees no problems there at all um, they are comfy the one thing about them um, and I'll have it in the description below they're a little heavier um, that they weigh a little bit more than some of the other pants so Cooler weather, so I'm here in Bakersfield, California. Um, we have milder winters. I mean, coldest we probably get is somewhere in the low 30s. Um, the hottest we get though is like 110 to 118. These would not be pants I would wear during the summer. Um, so again, uh, there are some lighter weight, uh, more breathable pants, but um, if you don't live in somewhere where it's hotter than blazes, um, or you get cold easily. These are fantastic pants. They're comfortable. Um, you know, they're not too baggy. Let me see if I can angle this down. Not, not too baggy. Um, so love these pants. Um, they're comfortable pants. They feel like I'm wearing sweatpants more than anything. So that is the Vertec Delta Stretch Pants. So uh, let me just change real quick. I'm going to show you guys the other pockets they have. Okay, guys. So Couple more pockets to show you on the Vertex Delta Stretch jeans. First, on the front zipper. By the way, the zippers on these, good zippers. Um, they could be like a half inch longer though. They are just a little short in my opinion. But on the inside of the zipper, right on your fly, there's this little extra pocket. You could throw you know, a $20 bill in here, handcuff key, whatever the case may be. There's also, two additional pockets, uh, one on the right hand side, and again, this is a, a top a top slot here, and then one around the back, uh, also a top slot. So again, big enough for you know a handcuff key, maybe some small um, escape and evasion equipment. Obviously, if you're being legally detained, I wouldn't use my handcuff key, but you never know what's gonna happen. So, these come in three colors. Um, it'd be really nice if, uh, they had some more, but again, for um, I think I got these with uh, a code of one of the guys on YouTube. Got these for 60-ish bucks, so good pair of quality pants. Uh, no complaints there, so hopefully this review was able to help you guys. That was the Vertec Delta Stretch 2.0.
Till next time, um, I would call that a wise buy. That's my humble opinion. That is a great buy, good pair of pants, good pockets, good layout, good durability. They're nice and stretchy. I love stretchy pants and they're comfortable. So that one's a win. Until next time, have a great day.